Uh, grand rising people. Happy Saturday, man. Um, I, uh, want to talk about, you know what I'm saying, a lot of people, man, a lot of these celebrities on, uh, you know, this, uh, social media, like, you know, YouTube, Instagram, and so forth, man. A lot of these guys, man, I'm, you know, I'm going to mention one particular individual who goes by the name of, you know, his title, the Calisthenic King. Uh, he's, you know, very, you know, he's notorious, you know what I'm saying, for, you know, handstand push-ups. You know, I've been watching him for years, you know what I'm saying? And I'm like, even when I was, you know, overweight, 240 pounds, you know, I was like, wow, you know, dude is very impressive. But, you know, a lot of calisthenic guys, they don't really do a lot of legs, you know what I'm saying? And I noticed, you know, that um, the only one that probably do a lot of legs, you know what I'm saying, and I say big ups to him, you know what I'm saying, is uh, Juice, you know what I'm saying? Uh, he has another name uh, called The Beast, but, you know, he, he goes by the name of Juice, you know what I'm saying? Both of them are from my hometown, you know, New York City, you know what I'm saying? But this particular dude, man, from the Bronx, you know, bald-headed brother, handsome, you know, good-looking brother. But, um, you know, I noticed, man, that... um. You know, I issued a challenge, you know, to the brother, you know what I'm saying? And I had asked him about doing squats, 500 squats, you know what I mean? The dude basically got got an attitude, you know what I mean? I'm like, maybe I caught him off guard, I caught him off balance, you know? Well, I was, you know, at a lot of guys didn't, you know, in prison, a lot of guys don't like training legs. Me, I, you know, have a, a little background, you know, in, you know, martial arts. I used to, you know do a little something, something. But one of the things that I learned, you know, that in order to, you know, the environment where I was at, I had to be strategic. So I had to basically, you know, uh, focus on, you know, movements that would, you know, add more, you know, power to my punches. You know, I focused on my stomach and I focused on uh, legs in the form of Tyson squats, regular body squats, lunges, and so forth. Um, yeah, uh, I did train my legs for endurance and strength. And I did that to help me stand up in a fight. You know what I mean? And uh, a lot of the guys I had fights with, it didn't matter how big they were. You know, um, they didn't last because, one, when you do a lot of squats, you know, it's like doing a form of cardio. And then you get a little bit of size. And you get some definition in your legs. And, of course, you build stamina or endurance. And I used to love fighting guys on the rail who didn't, you know, practice stamina, you know, training, endurance training. And a lot of them, they smoke. But not to get off the subject. But this particular guy, you know, I issued a challenge to him, you know, and the challenge still stands. You know, I even sent him a video. His response was, um, well, you know, you do... Um, 10 sets of 50 push-ups and 10 sets of 50 squats. Well, my response was, one, I'm not going to do no 10 sets of 50 uh, push-ups. I do, you know, upper body all the time. I'd rather do uh, 100 squats, okay, or do 200 squats or do Tyson squats. I'm, I'm more interested in duration. I have videos you know, now some of them may not be uh, ass to grass. Some of them may be parallel. Some of them might be quarter squats. But the good thing about it is it helped me with my deadlifts. It helped me with my um, trap bar deadlifts. It helped me with my farmer's walk, yo. You know what I mean? And, um, yeah, I've been doing them for years. And um, yeah. <laughs> My legs on the real they strong, you know what I'm saying? Um, I have to slow down, you know, as, of course, as I get older, you know what I'm saying, and learn how to warm up thoroughly, not just rushing into it. But the challenge still stands. Um, calisthenic king, you know. You, calisthenics is not just upper body, man. It's all the way around, you know what I mean? Uh, Chris Haraya, you know, Thanex, you know, he does a lot of planches, you know, um, Strong upper body, you know, but um, I I sell I I issued a challenge to him, five hundred squats, 
You know what I'm saying? For real. Um, I don't care about clout. I'm not clout chasing. I don't have a lot of um followers on Instagram, um, uh, on Facebook. But the thing about it is, hey, I'm just an old man. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, I'm not well famous or whatever, and I'm not trying to be famous. The thing about it is, a lot of people, for one, are being uh, not being informed about the importance of training legs. You know, there are benefits in training legs. And when you have a guy who uh, is doing a whole bunch of push-ups, a whole bunch of pull-ups, a whole bunch of muscle-ups, and don't train legs, people, for one, you know, have a lopsided view, you know, and they think that's what calisthenics is all about. No. I train these legs, yo. You know what I'm saying? Um, I read about Navy SEALs. You know, I read about Mike Tyson and how he trained his legs. You know, um, Herschel Walker. Yeah. You know, if you can't do 500, do do 50. If you can't do 50, do 25. But, you know, people that I train, especially the women, I always emphasize the importance of legs. Because when you train your legs, your body produces, you know, growth hormone as well as testosterone. It don't matter if your legs are skinny, flabby, or whatever. You'll get some form of benefit, you feel me? Especially thermogenesis, you know what I'm saying, a.k.a., you know what I'm saying, sweat, perspiration. But, uh, yeah, man, calisthenic king, um, I got your, I got all your texts, man, and um, I didn't know your attitude would be like that, bro. I mean, you seem to be very professional. Me, <laughs> I ain't shit, you know what I'm saying, for real, you know, I'm gonna say what I gotta say and whatever, you know what I mean, but, uh, yeah, man, I came to you, it was more, you know, friendly, you know, and, uh, I'm gonna tell you like this, fuck the body way, we'll do this, like I said, man, if I ever come to New York, man, or go back home, I'm gonna be looking for you, man, and I wanna go live, I wanna go public, I wanna challenge you in legs, you know what I'm saying? And that's for real. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. We'll do 500 squats. We'll do lunges. You know what I'm saying? We'll do, we'll take lightweight and go high rep. You know what I'm saying? Until one of us fall out. Straight up and out. And this ain't no testosterone booster. This ain't no trend. This ain't no steroids or nothing. This is rage, yo. You know what I'm saying? This is constructive anger. I'm not going to let up off you. And then the thing about it is, man, you had the nerve to say that, you know, it really hurt my feelings because I'm like, you were like, if you don't stop sending me videos or, you know, typing or texting, I'll be forced to block you. Wow. Really? I got underneath your skin like that? I just asked you simply, man, you know what I'm saying? The, the, you know, you, 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 you put a video of your of you in a sauna doing Oh, I just did 10 sets of 50 uh, push-ups. Okay, well, my my thing was, okay, well, do 10 sets of 50 squats. Okay? You have a nice upper body and everything, you know what I'm saying? And I've seen you do, you know, 50 squats in one of your videos. You offer the challenge. Do more. You know what I'm saying? For real. Because a lot of people, a lot of young men, you know, even, you know, say my grandson, i I, I have videos where I don't have him doing just upper body. I have him doing deadlifts. See what I'm saying? I have him doing squats, farmer's walk. You know what I'm saying? For real. See? So the thing about it is, man, I'm going to, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to make it my aim to start exposing some of you individuals, man. I still, I have your, I have your text. And I will, if I if people don't believe me, I will up, up, upload the things that you said. I'm like, wow, man. I mean, it really is nothing. You know, it's just the thing about it is I'm coming, I'm coming to eat, man. You know, I just want a challenge, you know. And it's not about how big you are, how strong you are. It's about just having fun straight up and down. <laughs> but anyway, yo. If you if y'all see this video, man, you tell Calisthenic King, man, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? To make more videos on legs. You know what I'm saying? We have a lot of guys who have who, who do a lot of upper body but don't train legs. Hmm. Alright? One love, y'all, and happy Saturday. Peace.